Hello, 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 everyone. Thank you all for joining. Thank you all for joining. And don't hesitate to say hi whenever you are here so that I can be able to acknowledge your presence. Uh, thank each and every one of you for being here. It is a privilege to have you guys around. So don't hesitate to say hi. And uh, feel free to ask any questions you want to ask. Yeah, okay, it is done. So, thank you each and every one of you for joining. Yeah. Let me wait a little bit. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. If you are here, feel free to say hi. Let me know where you are connected from. And so I can, I can acknowledge your presence, you know. So, oh, it's very hot in there. I think I have to open my... I have to open the window over there. It's very hot. In there. It's very hot. I feel very, very oh, organized better. Yo, thank you all. Thank you all for joining. And before we, I go straight, straight to on point, please, if this is your first time here, feel free to click the subscribe button and like and share and say something. Let me know where you're connecting from so I can be able to acknowledge your presence. And also, please consider subscribe to my new channel, yeah, Jita Music yeah, UK. Greetings, Joel. Greetings, Jita Music. How are you? How are you? How is your evening going? I hope you had a great weekend. Yeah, this is your boy, Joel Tamar, right here online. I miss you guys. I miss coming on live to be able to share with you and to ask about how you guys are doing in your respective countries and uh, cities in the world or village or town or whatever place you are. So in tonight's video, uh, tonight live, I'm going to share my experience in Slovakia and uh, everything I experienced there and alongside answering as many questions that I got asked in the community. So feel free to say hi and drop your comments that, uh, and drop your questions so I can answer you. Thank you. And this is my second channel, so please uh, consider subscribe to my, sec my second channel. So please, please, please. So my experience in Slovakia. I came through from Czech Republic. And when I came through from Czech Republic, I took the train that took me direct to Kočice. Yeah, it's very difficult for you uh, for, for me to say uh, the name, but that is how it, this, yeah, that is how it, it is called or it is spelled at K O S I C H. It is the second largest city in the country, and it is considered as even the most beautiful in the country. Uh, where are you now? I'm right in France, man. And how is your evening going? 
Jita, I'm right in France. So I had a great time in uh, Slovakia. It was short, you know, as life of a traveler. Sometime uh, you want to have more time, but no, because of the mission. The mission is the number one, your purpose first. So I couldn't be able to stay. Uh, if I would have loved, I would have loved to stay more to be able to experience more of, you know, uh, of the country. Uh, it was cool. The accommodation was great. The transport system around the country was great. And um, um, is that where you base? Yes, this is my base. This is my base. If you have been, how long have you been following me? Because if you have been following me for some time now, let me say more than some months or, or year, you would have, you know, uh, and already know that this is my base. I live in France, even though I am originally from Nigeria. I am Nigerian. I am Nigerian. So, but I live in France. So, guys, whenever you are here, don't hesitate. If this is your first time, Jita Music, please consider subscribe. Subscribe to my channel and uh, share it with your friends and loved ones if you like what i do here yeah, of course i know you will like it that is why you are here so please share my my channel with your friends and loved ones and ask them to subscribe and help me to grow the channel thank you uh amanuel get us i hope i said it very it's difficult for me amanuel i hand uh, i am work in romania from Ethiopia. oh shout out Shout out to uh, my people, my Ethiopian people, and also to my Romanian people. Are you the guy I met in CBU? I don't know. Emmanuel, are you the guy I met in CBU? Let me know. Because I met a, an Ethiopian guy in CBU. I am new to your channel. Oh, how long? How long have you been here? Jita Music. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Please subscribe. Don't hesitate to subscribe and like this, like the live and like my videos and share, 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 share with your friends and loved ones. Ask them to subscribe so that they can get blessed also, get inspired, or maybe find my videos helpful that can help them in one way or the other. What inspired you to begin travel blog? Oh, I just want to share because in the beginning I, I was traveling a lot. And uh, when I came back, I will just take only some few photos. And sometimes I even forget that I've passed through places like this. So and uh, as time goes on, I like to share my journey. So when I started doing the travel vlogs, I find out that people, uh, it is helpful for people. And people always ask me to say, uh, Joel, how do you do it here? How do you do it in my, my early travel vlogs? So then I started to have the, the hunger to help. I don't know, I was, but anyway, uh, as a young man, I always have that, uh, um, that thought, always, I always want to help. I always want to be a, of a help to humanity. So then when I started traveling, I started making the travel vlogs and I find out that it is helpful to uh, people, countless people, people that are maybe some of them, I would never meet them in the whole of my entire life, but it is helpful to them in their respective countries that maybe they want to visit where I want to visit, so they learn from it and it helps them. So that is what makes me to, you know, uh, keep on doing. And as time goes on, it seems like, like I'm addicted to it. So Jita, that is your answer. I hope I, I've answered it as early as, as um, much as I can be able to share because I want to give shout out to everybody that is coming in the community. So say hi whenever you are here so that I can give you shout out cryova no i've never been to cryova okay okay that means you are a different guy so how is cryova i think there is a girl a romanian girl that i met in cluj sorry girl if you are here and i forget to yeah, i met you i think it's cluj it's cluj yes she invited me to cryova uh, uh cryova i said it's a very cool place so one day i will visit them uh boom uh, boom link Boomlik vlog. I think this is a YouTuber. Uh, welcome to Morocco. Oh, thank you, thank you, man. Thank you. 
I can't wait to visit Morocco. I can't vis wait to visit Africa. It's going to be awesome. And what city are you from from Morocco? Boom Lake. Maybe a couple of weeks. It's an interesting and helpful channel. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, you see, uh, comments like this, feedbacks like this, uh, give me the hunger to keep on going. That is just me. Uh, I'm just happy that I can be of a help to humanity. So thank you for sharing. I really appreciate it. So if you are here, if my videos, the channel have helped you in one way or the other, please feel free to, to say and comment. Sometimes share it in the comment section. It helps me, you know. It gives me more strength to keep on doing what I do because uh, it is nice to see that what you are doing is helpful. So it's more interesting and it gives more energy, you know. I think you know what I try to say, please. So whenever I... I you find my channel helpful, help you in one with the other, please don't hesitate to always drop a comment. So it is helpful. And like the videos, like the videos and subscribe and share with your friends, friends and loved ones. Ask them to subscribe, it's free. Just help me to grow the channel. That is a way you can be able to appreciate me. Thank you. How do you find it traveling being a Christian? No, I never has problem with uh, that. Uh, it's normal. Uh, for me, I never have problem as being a Christian because uh, my religion, in fact, even Christ, Christ, Christian, a Christianity for me is not even a religion. It's a relationship. So it is a misconception, misinterpretation of our world. Christianity is not a religion, it's a relationship from between me and you and your God. Religion is people who are religious. They will say, because you are the same religion, uh, religion like me, so then I have to do things with you. I, I, will li I like him because it's my religion. It is for my religion. I will uh, go out with him. I will make business with him because it's my religion. That These are religious people. That is a religion. Christianity, so for me, my mindset, and then our God said, it is written everywhere in the Bible that if you love God, you have to love your fellow man and woman. You are not there to divide. You are not there to tell anyone, to detect anyone, to be like you before you have to love him. So I never find it, uh, I don't have that problem with anywhere, uh, with anyone, with anywhere I go, because it is a personal relationship between me and my God. So that is what I can say. Agade City, you have Instagram. Yes, yes, yeah, this is my Instagram. Follow me on my Instagram, guys, please. Uh, add me also on my Instagram, where you can get spontaneous raw videos also. This is my Instagram. And also, please consider subscribe to my second channel. My, this is my second channel, Joel Tamara. Consider subscribe also to my second, second channel. Thank you, everyone, for your subscription, for your great work, for your great support, I may say. The city of Ag uh, uh, Agadi City, you have Instagram. Yes, yeah, I have. Yulia Shen, Yulia, I which place you have traveled to is the least pleasant for a black person. I know Yulia, long time. How are you? I think this is a, a friend from uh, um, Belarus. Yeah. The least place that is not good for black people that is, you know, I, I said it, me, I'm, I'm a very blunt and direct person, so I don't care. Uh, this is how I do my things. I think Yulia, the long time she's, she's following me, so she know how I do my things. I'm a direct person. Cyprus. Cyprus is the least unpleasant place for a black person. Cyprus. I think you live in Romania. No, no, <laughs> I don't live in Romania. <laughs> hey, don't try to influence me now. Are you inviting me to come and live in Romania? <laughs> anyway, shout out to my Romanian people and my friends in Romania. What is your work? What is your work in Romania? Maybe I need, what is your work? What is your work in Romania? Maybe I need your help for information. I don't really understand. Are you trying to ask, ask me what is, 
work like or how to find a work in Romania, please uh, reformulate your question, please. Thank you. Uh, what about temptations? What kind of temptation you mean? Uh, temptations are everywhere. As, as long as we live in this world, we are about to have temptation. We are about to have temptation. It is only God that can, is, we are all living by his grace. No, no, no one of us can, can escape it without God. It is the mercy of God, if not no one. I'm a very stubborn boy. I'm very stubborn, yes. I, I do things that sometimes I know that as a Christian, like it is even the, the, the mercy of God I can say I'm a Christian because none of us is worthy. So temptations are everywhere. You just have to, it's only the mercy of God. Yon O Kanigula Mo Pete. Your name is very, very difficult. Anyway, I handed Mopete. I from Cameroon, but staying in North Cyprus. Our school, university ships, and jobs to get good pay in Romania and lifestyle good too, and easily as a black Africa to have a white Romanian girlfriend. Look. About girlfriend, why I have I have this is why sometimes I make video of these uh, interracial marriages. Man, in this world we are forget about the propagandas. Women from every society, you as a black man, if you know who you are, you get yourself right, they love you. Period. It is only some conservative and some like jealous societies that against black people will close their women, uh, that will suppress their desire, the desire of their women against black people. But even when these women have opportunity, whenever they have a opportunity to date a black man or marry a black man or maybe even run away from them uh, run away from the country with the black man they fell in love with they are ready to do it direct i'm telling you from my heart so anybody i'm seeing a lot even black americans i'm even surprising because in america i think they are they they are mixed there and uh, i've seen a lot of uh, americans that uh, are dating and intermarrying so sometimes i see some Black Americans are asking that question that I don't know how I come up, but no. And even some of my brothers in Africa, okay, even Africa, I know that, yes, uh, it, we, um, Africa, some countries, we are not really mixed. There, there is no much white people there. It's very, very few. Okay, I can understand to answer them. But when it comes from sometimes from Black America, sometimes I am kind of surprised. And so my brother, anywhere you are, if today you live in here in Europe, it is all depend on you. Are you ready to marry? Are you ready to date? Are you ready to be serious? It's all depend on you as a man. Any woman will be after you, depend on who you are. Then um, about study, uh, I think lifestyle in Romania is less expensive. It's one of it's one of these uh, less expensive cities in. Um, countries in in Europe that you can study there, so it is good. And also, they pay they pay the maximum wages there. If I don't forget, is like six seven hundred euro, six seven hundred euro. No, it's not four, four five because I was there almost one and more than a year ago. I forget already that it it is not more than maximum eight hundred. It's not more than maximum eight hundred. Yes, so I cannot really, uh, uh, I don't remember the right figure right now. So, but you can check it online. Maybe they can give it uh, online, you can find it. So please, the lifestyle, and the lifestyle is good. Look, most of these places that sometimes people say they are racist or whatever, or they don't, uh, they are, they don't like black people, it's all a lie. Some of the places that they say that even bad to black people are the most good to black people. It is all propaganda. So I hope I've answered your question, uh, John from Cameroon. Hi, hello. 
Yeah, hello, this is my Chinese friend, because your name I cannot even, uh, I cannot say, I don't know how to call your name, so hey, this is what I can say, and uh, thank you, I've taken a lot of time to explain to Jun from Cameroon, so uh, people don't respect black people in Cyprus or generally foreigners. As a black person, you are like a target. If you are, Yulia, you, it's been a long time you follow me, except you don't really take time to watch the videos. Uh, as a black person, you are like a target. You are like, as they see you automatically, it's like they misbehave. They just misbehave. Though I have uh, comments from other ethnicities, uh, like a Chinese guy that also shares experience in all countries, England, uh, uh, even Americans, all, everyone have shared their experience in that country. So if you, sometimes when you watch the video, take your time to even to read the comments, read what fellow travelers, people who have been there, their experience, then you can get even more. There are some things I didn't even say in the video because it's becoming too much. I was also discriminated when I took the bus, when I, when I was coming back home. So there are a lot of, even in the airport. So, and people, some, there are some travelers that already commented that also people from America, from England, from all part, all part of the world. They have said, so take your time to also, when you watch this video, sometimes even take your time to, to read the comments. Patrick, Patrick, hello, love, 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 love. Patrick, how are you? Thank you for joining. I am from Taiwan and I love I love videos. After I see your video, I go to Bulgaria. Oh, <laughs> so where are you now? Where are you now? Are you in Bulgaria? <laughs> oh, nice. Shout out to my people from Taiwan. <laughs> For those who ask about international marriage, if you both have the same values and respect each other, it is very fine. I am white and married to a black person. No problem because of the skin. Okay, okay. So in the community you have heard, she said she's married to a black man. So it is no problem. No problem. It is all depend on what you want. So if you guys, your, your values, your own... Uh, desire what you want to do, color like correlate goes together. It's okay for you. So this is it. Patrick, Patrick, love, love, love. How are you, Patrick? Where are you now? Rush gods. Hello, love your videos. Could you please answer what passport you have? How did you finance your travel? How much did you spend visiting almost every European country? That is my own. Oh, this is too early for me to share more about how I travel, how I make money, how much I pay. These are videos when I will be like almost, let me say, more than 100,000 to 500,000. Then I will share my story. These are my intimate stories. So, and these are even powerful sto uh, stories that. I, I make seminar for people can like I, I will make seminar for so it is too early to go more details about my life and how I do my things for now. Those videos are coming, but not now. Those time is coming, but not now. Which country do you appreciate the most? Are you married yourself? No, I'm not married yet. Uh, country I appreciate the most. The Eastern Europe, some part of some countries in the Eastern Europe, not all countries. So the Eastern Europe. So before your, your questions are coming in, let me continue sharing my experience in, uh, in Slovakia. Beko, I think this is my, uh, my um, friend from Brazil. Hello, how are you, Beko? Thank you for joining. Man, you guys, you have to still wait for some time. It is too early for those videos. So, guys, I came down from, you know, and uh, please, please 
like this video, like this video, and continue to subscribe and share my videos with your loved ones and friends. If whoever you think that can benefit from what I do, and uh, you know, uh, help me to grow the channel. If you know I'm bringing value to the community, I'm impacting you positively, helping your 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 journey or maybe your studies and or your work, wherever place you want to go. That you find my video helpful to you, please continue share my videos with your friends and loved ones and ask them to subscribe and like this video, please. And consider also subscribe to my new channel, please, because it's going to be explosive, it's going to be raw. In this new, uh, in the beginning of the year, I've said this time is going to be a more different, like more street interruption and um, interaction sorry uh, running into people spontaneous interview because it is spontaneity that is where we get the real the real truth the real vibe of the vlog and from the people so a lot of that is going to come and the same time also um uh, on my instagram so subscribe to this my second channel joel tamara tv please subscribe and share it with your friends and loved ones, ask them to subscribe. Help me to get it to, to 1K, to 1K, because we are, I think we are almost 100. So at the end of this live, please let us make it at least more than 100, 100 subscribers already, because it is already, it is already 92 people, I think, 92 subscribers. So, so please help me to subscribe to my new channel and make it to get to more than 100 subscribers, uh, subscribers at the end of this live. Thank you. And add me. On my Instagram, add me on my Instagram, and along the line, it's going to be explosive because there are some contents that I cannot be able to share on YouTube direct. You will get them on Instagram. And also follow me on my Facebook page. It is free, guys. So it's going to be explosive. A lot of great things is coming. Thank you. So, so hello, friend. Uh, Biko, I appreciate the girls from Norway. Hey, hey, hey. The Norwegian girls. <laughs> I don't know. You like Norway. You like the Norwegian girls too, but don't worry. Norway time is coming. It is a marathon. It is not a sprint. Every country, I'm going to every country gradually. We're going to learn. You're going to rock, man. Immigration in the UK is coming more tighter. It, it, it is coming more tighter. You know, I cannot say I'm not... Uh, these are all political issues, so... I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to say it. I don't know what you really mean, but I, I think I've heard about that, especially against uh, Africans. So it is all politics. It, it depends on our African leaders and government to be able to, because uh, look, I think enough at some certain stage, you need to like say enough is enough and do something about your continent and your country and you know improve the lifestyle and the value of life of the people in the country. So it is all political thing. I am not a politician, so I cannot help in that aspect. Biko, yeah, I am good. I am good, man. Thanks for asking. Yeah, yeah, it is normal, man. You guys are always asking how I'm doing. So it is. that is why sometime in this live section, I'm here because of you guys. I just want to know where you're connecting from, where you are, how are you doing, how is life, you know? I just love it that way. So. That is why it is good so that I can be able to interact with you. Yeah, I'm doing great. I'm doing great. You can see you know, the glory of God is radiating all around me. So what, what can I ask more from? It's only the only thing I have to say to thank you, Jesus Christ, my God and my personal Savior, my inspirator, my motivator, my everything, even though I am a stubborn boy. But by his grace, I can still call him my all and all. Thank you, Patrick, for the loves. Love, love you, love you, man. Love you, man. Thank you, man. Patrick, where are you? Where are you? Where you go next? Mm, that is secret. That's left for me to know now and for you to discover right on my channel and or yes, right on my platforms. It is left for me to know now and left for you to discover when the time comes on my platform. Will you be interested in collaboration? Why not? In the future, why not? If I check out the person, what kind of content he has. Anyway, I already wanted to be collab uh, want to collaborate with some of my friends, uh, my colleagues here. 
but uh, it didn't work out because it's not easy because the moment that time the guy was like vlogging around africa or something so he's out on a mission so you know when we are in mission we don't have much time so because everything is programmed so it is not easy it's not easy so this is only what i can say it's not easy so we couldn't be able to make the collaboration but in the future if i run into or uh, there are a lot of guys reaching out to me so that we have to look depend on our availability uh the time we have and uh, depend on our content then why not why not it is a win-win if it's a win-win it's good so we learn from each other it's good for me it's good how is the woman the woman there uh, the, the woman there which woman and we are we are hello dark knight how are you thanks for joining where are you connecting from and which woman are you talking about i camera work and media etc uh, you mean like um collaboration sharing camera work and media or learning about how to vlog i don't know i don't understand what you really mean jita music please go also to ireland yeah no problem it is every country is is every country i'm going gradually the man of the secret are, are, are good <laughs> yeah yeah i like it i like it to like to be surprising hey joel is here uh -huh, i like it that way you are a cheerful guy kind of friend to have a hey, hey. oh thank you thank you biko thank you thank you and you too you seems like a great guy so even though i don't really see who you really looks like but hey from the what you write seems like a good guy also i also um i run into to some slovakian guy uh that was uh, i think he, he saw it was in cyprus or he saw my cyprus videos and he came to said hi to me in Bratislava, which I really, um, uh, which I I make, uh, I did a video with, and also an American guy that my video was helpful to him uh, in Poland. My Poland, my Poland video, my Polish videos were uh, helpful to him. So I met him. He's not in coach yes. So it was it was fun. It was fun. So maybe one day, why not? I run into some of you uh, in in some countries or, or in your country. You're welcome. You're welcome, Biko. My bike, uh, bike, no topo. I mean to support you as a cameraman or creative support. Uh, uh, support. Ah, oh, but I need a cameraman, of course. That is what I've already said like a few weeks ago. Uh, but where are you? Where do you live? Uh, okay, Jita, you from the UK? You said, if I didn't make mistake, sorry. I think you from the UK. Yes, I really need a cameraman. That is true. That is true. Shekina, yeah, how are you? I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. And you, thank you for joining. Where are you connecting from, Shekina? So my time in Czech Republic uh, was great. Was great. I was a little bit uh, though. Almost my time there, it was raining. So I have to like be stubborn. I think I miss I miss someone's. I like the Netherlands, but I never been there. I am in Cape Town, South Africa. Oh, okay, okay, the Netherlands. Okay, yeah, very soon, very soon we are going. We are going gradually, so we're going to see all these places. So you will see it through my eyes, Patrick. You will see it through my eyes. I'm doing good, Chekina. Blessing fam. Yeah, one bin, one bin. Shout out to my reggae boy. Thank you, thank you for the reggae man. The reggae man in the in the building. Uh, he's from Jamaica, one bin. Yeah, one bin is from Jamaica, if I don't make a mistake. From a Kingston. Denmark. Oh, what city are you from? From Denmark. Shout out to my Danish people if you are in the community. What is your preference, black? What is your preference, black or white? I think this guy, I have already answered this your question in one of my videos. I don't like I don't need any agenda type of thing or stereotypical things. No, no, no. I don't like this. Please, I don't like this. I've answered you. 
I told you, I just like women. I don't care if the woman is white or is black. The most important thing is that if she can be herself and what she's putting out there, if it's what she really is, simple as that. Because I'm a simple person. I don't need a complicated life. The world is already too complicated. Relationship is already too complicated already. For So I need a simple person that really know what she wants. And don't lie. Because for me, I'm a very honest person. So immediately I see that you're like, you're lying. Bye-bye. So it does not mean any color. It just depends on the person. So... In Slovakia, the cost of living is cheap, though they are using euro. But things are very cheap. And the transport system also around the country is very cheap. And uh, that is where I also initiated some of the, the content that uh, like uh, testing people level of patience, that is where it also started and many other contents. So Slovakia, and but when I came in, I was a little bit surprised because it is not like that kind of Estovacan, that, that kind of, I'm very sorry for my Slovakian people, but I'm just kind of being, being honest. It's not like that kind of like um, elegant, like the way uh, Czech Republic can be. Czech Republic more elegant, more like more modern in a way, the buildings. But Slovakia, it has just kind of like normal vibe, dull and very calm, but it has its own charm on its way. It has a lot of mountains. So if you are someone who like hiking, mountain, it is a paradise for you. So, and the people are very chill, very cool. So it's another great place. Though I have already known about Slovakia before because, because many, many years ago, I had a Slovakian like girlfriend before. So I, the moment I wanted to visit there, then we lost contact. So I know the way she treated me and back then where we met, it is, it is in holiday resort at in holiday resort, I think it's in Italy, one of my holidays in Italy. So uh, they, the people are very kind, the men, like they came in group. They were like a volleyball players. So I see the way the people, they welcome me, both the men, the boys, all. So I was like already having a very good thought that the Slovakians are cool people. So, and when I get in, this is my first time after many years, before, when I lost contact with her, I couldn't be able to go. But finally, I went down this time and I can see that, oh, it's a really cool people. So Slovakia is also very great. They are great people, great country. And if you like hiking and some other cities like Banstad Bistrica, is, I like it. I really did really exploit that much, that country. So there are a lot of great places also, like even the mountains, man, so much. And the Czech people, are like they love Slovakia because of that. It's a very beautiful country. They, they depend on what you are, you 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 want to see in a country. So for me, with the full package of everything, because when I said beauty, is the full package of everything, social life and all that. The social life is very great. Transport system good. Cost of living is good. The people no 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 excellent for me. Though occasionally you can run into some people that is might not be so nice, it's like everywhere, but the majority of people are very great. One being, love your vibes. Always, my brother, Jamaica is your place to like wise Nigeria to me, fam. My brother, I cannot wait to come to spend my time with my people. Yes, I cannot wait to come and see my reggae boys and get some reggae move. I cannot. Because it is, we are all brothers. And I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. The time is coming. So it is a marathon. So I'm coming. I, I'm coming. One minute. You will see me. You will see me. I'm coming. Which country, which country that you travel are more nice? 
I've said it. Oh, okay, maybe okay. You I think you came in a little bit late. Yeah, um, the Eastern Europeans, some countries in the Eastern Europeans are more nice. John, thank you, my bro. My experience is that before I was in dating online apps with a Romanian girl, her name was Orna. She was single. We were really loving together, but I never went there to surprise her. Why don't you went there to surprise her? If you are talking to her, you guys are cool. And uh, I think you said you were... Where are you now exactly? I think I forget because a lot of people... And I forget, he, he have said, he have said, I think he said where he is now. Okay, he's in Cameroon. Okay, you are still in Cameroon. Okay, you are still in Cameroon. Okay, you can try. Maybe when you are going to study there, you can meet up. Try, try. They are, they are lovely people. You know, this is also the problem of a traveler because even me, during the travel, the, hey, I'm a man of mission. So sometimes I just have to go. <laughs> it's not easy. It's not easy. Right? The distance relationship is not easy. Uh, come to London. Come to London. Yeah, trainer, trainer. Don't worry. London is just close by, but I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Thank you for the invitation. And how are you today, trainer? Trainer. I hope I said it very well. Which country in Europe you find that girls are more attractive? Man, you want to put me in trouble. You want some ladies here now from other countries started to say, so, oh, Joel, don't like us. Hey, you know, I'm a public person. I'm a people's person. I'm a people's person. So I cannot say, I cannot answer some questions. Guys, take it easy with me, man. Beauty, it all depends on who, uh, on what. It depends on your own values of beauty. Beauty depends on you. And they said beauty is in the eyes of the beholder. So... For me, every woman is beautiful, depend on what I want and depend on what you as a man you want. So every country I've visited, everywhere I've passed through, they are beautiful and amazing women. That is my answer. Finally, of our relationship breakdown, I profit to your channel. Greetings to honor my dear <laughs> yeah, I think it, why did it break a uh, breakdown because of the distance because you couldn't be able to go and see her. What happened? Tell me. Why did it break down? And oh no, if you are here, your ones on me from Africa, Cameroon is sending you love. He still he still like you, maybe distance problem. I am good. How about you? Doing great, trainer. You know, your brother is doing great. Doing great. Share more about you. Who are you, trainer? And how long you've been here? Please, guys, consider, consider liking this video and subscribe if this is your first time here. If you like what I do, uh, no, do I am not a perfect guy. So don't if you look at only my fault, then you will get everything wrong. So as long as you are not perfect, then never try to make me a perfect person. I'm just normal guy that you know is a very blunt and very honest guy the right person so guys keep on liking the videos and share with me share with me how long you've been here how did you find my videos i want to know and please consider subscribe to my second channel please and let us get it to at the end of this life i want that channel to be more than 100 subscribers and before the end of this year, let us take it to 1,000 subscribers, please. And I believe in you. You guys can do it. You, you guys can do more, more than that. So, and anyway, thank you also. Thank you so much for helping me to pass 20,000 subscribers. Thank you. Thank you. Love you guys. Th love you guys. Thank you. I can't do it without you guys. So, guys, please keep on subscribing. And share it with your friends and loved ones. Trainer, can I come too, please? <laughs> Trainer, someone, <laughs> someone, one being say want to come to visit. He want to visit the UK also. Okay, I am staying in not okay, not Cyprus currently. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, not Cyprus, but okay. 
but you can not not Cyprus is not that so far away. I don't know, but if you are, I don't know about your situation, but you can go and visit them. Uh, Romanian people are very cool. Uh, from my own perspective, as a black man, as an African, uh, the the women in the Eastern European women, some of them, not every, really looks like our women. So I like the vibe. They are really they are in they are just in their feminine. Most of them are in their feminine. So if you're a masculine person, you like them. You like them, and they are very very nice, and they are very honest. Romanian women are very honest. They will not, if they don't like what is happening, they will tell you. They will not beat around them. They are not like some ladies that they will doing different thing until they will stop. You will see that, oh, so she's just like uh, wasting my time. Romanian girls, I think, is more honest. And even in the videos, most of the girls, they talked about it. They are direct. So not like most other country girls that like they are kind of playing games engage maybe they're engaging you and at the same time they are engaging someone they are calculating of course security security reasons and your other calculation if they see someone who have more than that they will just before you know you think you are talking to someone that this person is uh, after you that you are engaged but you know don't don't you don't know that she just calculated so some of them will call them gold diggers so, but the Romanian girls, I think most of them are very honest. You will less, less of those kind of women that are trickish, that will turn you in the last minute. You will be surprised that, oh, I've been talking to this person. And at the end of the day, <laughs> she's talking to us. So it's like she's calculating. So this is, I think you understand. If you're a man, you understand where, I, where I'm going. Even women, they understand what I mean. So this is it. One being sure, it is a great country. Okay. Trena is inviting all of us. So all of us, we have to go and visit Trena in, in the UK. So Trena, what do you do in the UK? Where are you from now? I am in France. This is my base. I am a small YouTuber inspired by you. Oh, really? So what did you do in your channel, Trena? Nice. What is your content all about? I can I can check it out after the live. Trainer, send me an invitation letter, then I will find my way. <laughs> These guys are shooting, striking, trying their their luck, their their shots here. Patrick, Patrick, love you, love you. Thank you for all the loves you have been sending. Trainer, what's your channel? Okay, so guys, check her out, check her out, and support her. Watching from Rwanda. Oh, shout out to my Rwandese. How are you? I saw Rwanda today. I can't wait to visit Rwanda because it is one of the cleanest country in Africa. So I can wait to explore more, 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 and share the authentic and the raw, the real vibe of Africa that the world never see. And many, the, the media, the world media has never shown to the other, to this part of the world. So I can't wait. Glad my brother. Thanks, uh, uh, great thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No problem, man, no problem, no problem. I hope everything is so, tell us more about Cyprus because there are some people asking about uh, questions about Cyprus in here. For some second, I think Yulia, I don't know if she's still here. She's asking about questions about Cyprus. So maybe as you that is living in Cyprus, maybe she can benefit from your experience of what you face daily in the country. Jita 10, okay, this is a, this is a, a YouTube. So guys, please consider subscribing. Consider subscribing also to my channel and uh, also to the second one. Please, at the end of this live, let us take it because we are like only eight people, remaining only eight people for the channel to be uh, to be uh, 100, 100 subscribers. Let me shake it here. Please, guys, I'm shaking. Surprise me. Surprise me, guys, please. I'm shaking it now. I want to be surprised that it is already more than... 100 subscribers. 
Come on, guys. He's still, he's still 92. So, guys, please. Make it. Make it. Let us get to more than 100 subscribers at the end of this video on my second channel. Thank you. This is the name of the channel. Joel Tamara TV. Thank you. So, keep going, bro. Watching from Africa, Eritrea. Oh, Tewi. I, I hope I said Tewi. Hello, my people from Eritrea. Wow. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. I can't wait. I'm growing. I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm preparing very well so that I can come and explore the whole of Africa. Thank you. Thank you for joining. Uh, what city are you from, from Eritrea? Like for like. <laughs> okay. Travel channel. Okay. She's also doing a travel channel. Okay. Nice. I will check it out after. Trainer, I have a look. Okay. Wow, wow, wow. So, guys, you can also support each other direct, like the way these people, Jita and Trainer, is doing. Check them out, check them out. Support. I remember when I started, it wasn't easy. I didn't have uh, someone to help me. I go through the hard way. So everything I do, I do it in the hard way. I didn't have anybody to support me. So it is not easy. It is not easy. So I know what it takes to be, I, I, I know what it takes to be uh, a new YouTuber just coming up. So it's difficult, it's really, really difficult. Like imagine, I just have 92 uh, subscribers in my new channel that I did you know, two months ago. Or not even two months, like let me say two months ago. Yes, two, three months ago, when I started almost a year, I have done, I don't even have almost a, a hundred. So imagine, so it's because God has tried to open some doors for me, and God has opened some doors for me, so that is why. Because of this, uh, the main channel, that is why I can be able to get. So most of you people are going to subscribe there also. So please subscribe on my second channel. So and support young young um, YouTubers as well. How many language do you speak? Oh, I speak uh, my local my my language. Izo, I'm an Izo boy. Izo. It is one of the oldest tribe, one of the oldest. And I think it's a, about even the, like, that is his whole politics again, at least, if not, we are not even the fourth largest tribe in Nigeria. It's supposed to be among the top three. So it is another uh, uh, political issue. So we are the fourth largest tribe in Nigeria. And... Uh, that is where I come from, and we have one of the we have the major riches in the country, even. So, and I, I speak my language Ijo, and I try to understand some of our language in Nigeria as well. I speak English, French, Italian, understand some Polish, and uh, some Spanish and Portuguese because of these uh, two. Italian and French that I understand. So it makes me to understand when people speak Spanish and Portuguese, I can understand it. What what other language I understand again? Yeah, this this all uh, for now. Do you earn money in YouTube? Shekina. <laughs> this guy said. I'm just trying. I'm just a young YouTuber, so I'm just trying. Just little, just trying. Or you want to you want to pay me? Last time you were asking for my job. You 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 have a job for me, this guy. And your questions are always personal. What did I did did to you, Shekina? Capital city Asmara. Okay, Asmara. Asmara, okay, Asmara, yeah, of course, is one of the major, it is a most, 
one of the cities I can fail to visit whenever I will be in Eritrea. Trainer, the name of your channel, please. Yeah, Trainer, someone asking for your channel. Which country is the most unforgettable that you have ever been to? In what sense? Because negative has its own, positives has their own also. I leave Asmara. Okay, good. Of course, you will you will see me when I will be in Asmara. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. Guys, thank you. Thank you, each and every one of you for joining. It has been an awesome time so far, and I really appreciate you all. It is, okay, you mean positive. Okay, positive. Positive, the, the Eastern Europeans, the East, some of the Eastern European countries, and yes, so the, the, some of the Eastern European countries is the best my best experience is in these places yes some the likes of let me say romania bulgaria czech republic slovakia poland it's also a great place Yeah, the Eastern, some, some part of the Eastern European countries. What do you prefer, natural or urban environment when you travel? For me, it's all. Me, I'm like, I'm not like, um, I'm not a difficult person. <laughs> So I just, uh, and again, my vlogs are natural. So I don't like plan something, uh, not script, uh, not like uh, uh, re like the way most YouTubers or some vid vloggers do or filmmakers do. My things are all natural. Just like the way I come to talk now on this live, I didn't plan anything. Only what I know, okay, I want to make video, I want to make this live. This live is about my experience in uh, Slovakia. And at the same time, I want to shout with the community. I want to share, I want to answer questions. Give shout out to the community. That is my mindset. So then I allow my inspiration, I allow my, my uh, creativity and all that to run by itself. So I don't block my, my creativity. I allow, I flow. I flow. I don't know if I can try to explain what I really, what I really uh, want to. Uh, how will I say? I I hope I can be able to exp express and explain to you uh, the way I really want wanted it to be. But that is how I do my things. It's all inspiration. So most videos, like I'm doing in the channel, that even guys see, even with the women or the ladies in any country. So most of them are just inspiration. Then I like it. I see that okay, people like it. People always commenting. They want to. They want me to do that kind of video. Then I keep on doing it. So that I see that it is working. Of course, as a businessman, you do what is working for you. So this is it. The cleanest town in Africa, as Asmara. Really? Okay. I was thinking like uh, they were talking more about uh, Kigali. Kenya, no, no, sorry, uh, Rwanda, Rwanda is Rwanda. I was thinking about that, so it's Asmara. Okay, I can wait to see, brother. I really, brother, I really full joy your long videos these days. Oh, okay, yeah, this is one of the guys that was like, uh, wants me to make my videos more longer. So finally, you are satisfied. One bin, I'm glad that you have you are satisfied. And again, I'm coming up. I'm coming up with, um, uh, you know, uh, a video because most people are asking about dating in any country I visit, how it's like there, and all that. So uh, I think uh, I want, for me, I want to make it alive because so that you, I can, uh, so that I can answer your questions. 
the right questions, people, what you want to know. Because if I make it a vlog, maximum it will be about like almost 40 minutes or 30 minutes, something like that. Okay, it's fine. But I will miss your questions. So I think I'm thinking, I'm planning to make it a live dating in any country I visit, my experience. And I'm going to share some personal experience also, some dates I went to and my own feelings and my own thoughts about everything. So if you like it, if you like it, let me know in the, in the community right now, if you like it, because I've already put it out there. A lot of people are voting for me to make it a vlog, but the vlog has advantage and disadvantage. It will be more fluid and you will see, I will take you to walk around, show you a lot of places, you know, to visit, the, the, uh, to show you the place I am, but I will miss this kind of contact, your questions. So which one you prefer? You want me to make it a live video um, you, you, uh, you want me to make it a live streaming or vlogs, which one you prefer? Because for me, I prefer the live because I can be able to interact with you and answer some of your questions directly. Which country you had the worst experience in? Cyprus. Cyprus. I am a creative... I am a creative, bro. I get it. You like to impro um, improvise. Am I right? Anything I'm doing, I don't like, like it runs in my mind. I see it through my mind's eyes. And then I know, for example, I said, I want to do this live. Then the life is about my experience. My experience in Slovakia, that's all. Then I run it in my mind's eyes. What would I want to say? What would I want to share with the community? What would they love to know? Then it goes, then that's all. Then I know Then I leave all the rest, anything that comes along the way, allow myself to flow. So along the way, things that I didn't even think to say or to, act, to share will flow. And when they flow, then I allow myself to just go. So that is why I like it to be natural that way. I don't know how can I explain it, but I hope you can get it. Not Cyprus is a nice small country on the con on the controlled military of Turkish army. Turkish people, same women, are mostly hard. People also don't pay well job than South Cyprus, becoming very expensive place. Okay. So you as a Cameroonian, a black man, what can you share honestly, not political correctly? Or if you can decide to say no because you are still living there, you don't want any problem, I don't know, whatever. But honestly, what can you share of your experience as African people there, black people? I like it. Thank you. Shekina, which country most races you visited? This is, I've said it, uh, Cyprus. Cyprus, it's my first time even really having, this is blow to blow face. The video is there, watch the videos. Don't go to Cyprus, that is the title. It is a reason for me to say that and there are countless people, white, blacks, American, Indians, everybody is, have shared their testimony. Even Chinese, everybody. Even I think even few few I think I have a, a just a new comment few uh, isn't today or yesterday. Let me read one for you. Let me read one for you. Maybe so you can see it. I think there is one Cyprus comment here. There are so many, there are so many, we you know, uh, comments from different, different videos, so, so many comments. So guys, even don't uh, take it easy with me because sometimes, uh, sometimes I really 
I really want to answer, reply all of your uh, of your comments, but sometimes I cannot be able to make it. So I couldn't be able to get get it, but hey, maybe how? Huh? Oh, okay, okay. I, I stumbled across a very, a very important, uh, uh, very interesting comment here. But I don't know because of the, I don't need, you cannot see it clearly. Okay, let me read it. You see, she is Louisa. Her photo is here. Louisa Clem, Clementos. She's called Louisa Clementos. She said, Cyprus is my parents' country. She's a Cy Cyprus woman. Huh? Listen, she said, Cyprus is, a, uh, sorry, she said, Cyprus is my parents' country. When I visited Cyprus, most of my relatives didn't want to associate with me. They kept telling me that Australia, the country I live in, isn't as good or beautiful as Cyprus. I did really like the history and architect. I also liked through those mountains. The beaches are mainly pebble and are not as beautiful as the ones in Australia. I haven't been to Cyprus for 31 years. Good riddance to bad rubbish. See, you see what she said? Cypriot people are rubbish. This is a Cyprus woman insulting her people. So there are a lot of things. What I mean, well, I am not there for, I, there's so many. Uh, I don't know how to, uh, I'm not here, but if you don't believe it, you go. And when you go, you will learn the lesson in the hard way. You will see it for yourself. So you will know that at least I was honest to you. So this is what my experience in the country and even the Cypriot people are, are saying the same thing in the comment section. So read the comment section, you will see. Leave, uh, I don't know, I don't understand the, the, the rest of your question anymore. Which country you had the worst experience in 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 life? In in leave. I don't understand anymore, trainer. Your this your life. Please reformulate it. Keep on arguing, people. Keep on sharing the channel and keep on testing people' patience. Keep on sharing the love. <laughs> Did you know this very thing that you like? Countless people are bossing my boss are insulting me so hardly for these videos <laughs> and you are enjoying it you see you're, so our world is crazy show show for sure your dating experience okay i just came back from cyprus and i also add the you also add the what trainer share, share with us you also add the what The lie. I don't understand. Trainer can. Oh, okay, this is a. Um, I just came back from Cyprus, and I also add the. What does that mean, uh, trainer? Live. Okay. Okay. The live. Okay. Okay. The live. Okay. The live. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I understand now. Trainer, you you prefer me to share the um the uh, even trainer and this uh, uh, Tiwi. And uh, you prefer me to share um, the dating experience in each country on live. Okay, I got it now. Thank you. Because I'm like doing a lot of things. You may have to build the shan. The, what is that? Chanel or shan? What do you mean? Jita. I want to, I want you to do a, about of them farm. There is no easy way out the out out farm. Okay, <laughs> you want me to do more of the organ videos, <laughs> testing people's level of patience. Okay, to be in Africa is like almost you are in prison. Very difficult to move around freely with without a visa. 
Yeah, these are things, I, as I've said, our leaders, we supposed to, uh, like, we supposed to come together and settle this once and for all because it is not good. It's not good for us. We cannot grow. The economy cannot grow. And uh, many people have already seen, many great thinkers, even prophets have saying, no Africa can succeed alone. We need, we should not al allow each of us to feel like, all uh, unwelcome in our countries. As an African, we should not allow another African to feel un unwelcome in our country, but still we don't listen. We are not learning. And the worst thing, foreigners will come, we treat them even more better than ourselves. And we ourselves, we are not treating ourselves. Then after you, we will be complaining that people don't respect us when you don't respect yourself. So Patrick, we have to end, we have to stop this. We have to stop it. I hope the leader, people who are in position to take action, do the proper thing, the right thing. Impoverished means freestyle. Okay, uh -huh. because your gra me, I'm not a uh, professor. Uh -huh. Impoverished means freestyle. Okay, so I think we are in agreement. You like to let it flow. Yes, freestyle. Yeah, just let it uh, freestyle. Trainer, you mean Trainer Joe? Yeah, I think, yeah, that is a, a channel, I think. He already said it before. One being, okay, yes, this is it. Much love and respect from Greece. I love you. Thank you. Thank you. How, how are you? What city are you from, from Greece? Thanks for joining. Thanks for joining. Where are you from, from Greece? I prefer the live. Okay, trainer prefer the live. So yeah, because the live for me personally, I prefer it doing. Uh, I prefer doing it uh, live because I can answer most of the questions and I can share more. Because sometimes it's only in I in just a vlog along the line. Maybe you can miss some information. So you can forget some things. But in live, you take time. And people can answer, uh, ask you questions that maybe even remind you of what you have already forget to share, and you can share it. So I think it would have been much better that way. I had a bad experience in Cyprus. They, they made monkey noise when I was on the bus. Imagine that. When, when, when did you, when were you in Cyprus? When is the last time? Um, when you were in Cyprus, when? So people in the community can learn because there is a, uh, a friend here that I've just said that uh, maybe she's interested in going to Cyprus, so she wants to know. You may have built the channel and invite subscribers to a live section in a particular country. You want me to, like, you... You want me to invite some, um, I don't understand. You may have viewed the channel and invite subscribe to a live section in a particular country. Yeah, maybe you didn't really get what I'm saying. I'm saying about uh, my like dating experience in each country I visit and I would like to make it on live uh, than vlog because vlog, it would be maximum maybe 30 minutes or 40 minutes. It will. It is cool. It is fine. It's more more uh, elegant. They, they, you know, you can see a lot of places. You know, I can walk around some countryside or some city. So and some good cool streets. You know, you, you can get a lot of view. But I might miss some things along the line, and I might not have the opportunity to interact with you like this and to answer your questions. So this is what I mean. So, okay, yeah, this is, is normal. In the future, I'm going to do it more. I'm going to do it more. I've already, I have some friends like that are already even big YouTuber more than me, but we don't really, it's just question of time, just uh, time. In, in any moment from now, maybe we can start doing it. That is what I think is, is, is going to come. I am from Kavala city in Greece. Oh, oh, I didn't know the city. We, I think I know it's like uh, Athens, Thessalonica, and Corfu, something like that. Yeah, 
these are the cities I know. Okay, shout out to my people in Greece. I hope I have some people over there. I think you are there, so shout out to my people in Greece. In the north, in the north. Okay, okay. How many kilometers to Athens or Thessalonica? I just came back two days ago. Two days ago! Aha! Uh -huh. Two days ago! Wow. And how long did you stay in the country? Monkey noise in 2023. How foolish. Um, look, look, that is what I always tell that I've shared some videos. If so, the only way this thing can be stopped, we should stop playing victim. I've said it in the video, what happened to me in Austria. Black people stop playing victim. So if anybody like she in the future, anywhere we are, if whenever we get this kind of insult, we make the same noise to them because they are also monkeys. Monkey is everywhere. Monkey is every color. There's black monkey, there's white monkey. So make it monkey, make it monkey. If they throw you banana, take the banana, eat the banana, and give the, the uh, eat, eat half of the banana and give the rest to him. That you come and join me, you are a monkey to let us eat together. If you insult you, insult the person back. Because that is, the, if someone is bullying you, the only way is to stand up. But therefore, she as a woman, I can understand. But we, the men, we black people, black men, and even our government, they don't even care. They only care about money and the very, I don't know, it's crazy, man. So we should stop, stop this nonsense. We have been crying. Uh, if you do like this, you have to be the, someone is disrespecting you. You are speaking political correct grammars. That is, that is what bullies understand. Bullies does not understand grammars. If I'm, if I'm talking nonsense, if I'm not saying the truth right here, the, the, in anywhere in the world, since the existence of man, the bullies understand grammar? No. Did, did bully understand, please stop, please stop. I am a good person. Why are you disturbing me? Did bully understand that? No. Bully understand when you stand up to him. So black people should stand up. I prefer anything you, you do lives or vlogs. You just give me videos, bro. Plus, please make the videos longer, like up to an hour now fam wow <laughs> this guy was in 20 minutes so i make it like some almost 30 to 40 minutes now he's give, giving me one hour okay wow okay seven nine seven nine man me when i get in there in less than five hours in less than five hours they have already baptized me i wanted to go to lanaka and uh Ayenekba, something like the place they call Ayenekba, so there is more tourists and a lot of nightlife there, something like that. I said, me, go there again. No, no, no. I'm going back. It's okay. 700 kilometers from, from Thessalonica, uh, uh, from Athens, from, from, Thessalon uh, from Thessaloniki, that is uh, 215 kilometers. Oh, nice. Okay. Wow, 700 kilometers, that is like almost a day journey from, from there to Athens. Wow. Thank you, man. So tell us more about you. What do you do? Are you a student? You work as a... Tell us more about your city. Those of us that didn't know, I don't know about your city. So tell me more about your city. Skin folk don't mean skin... Don't skin folk don't mean kin folk. <laughs> this guy is a this guy are you a, are you a, a lecturer uh, the, your a grammatical man lol i heard that i heard that from a video you uh, a video youtube that in finland as your foreign person when if you can't speak finnish you won't get a job i would like to know please that is true I don't know, I don't know, but at least yes, uh, my friend that was uh, that is in Finland when he started, 
he doesn't really really speak that good Finnish language, but uh, he got a job. But at least you have to try. You know, when you go to a different country, that is why when you go to a different country, you have to learn. You have to be hope that you are a fast learner. Because if you are not a fast learner, it's difficult for you to find a job. Except you will be doing jobs around your your people, African people, where you can have some job doing. So I think that is true in true in many countries. Even in your country, in South Africa, yes, Patrick is from South Africa. So even South Africa, if I come to South Africa, and if South Africa was not speaking English, if you are speaking your language, for me to work in your country, it's going to be difficult for me because I guess many employees will, will not like to employ me because I cannot communicate. So it is something to think about. So you have to prepare if you want, like, want to go to places like that. You have to like prepare economically so you can stay for at least like some months and learn the language intensively or you try to learn it already at home for some months before you 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 move down this is what i can say do you know do you know any love boat to meet women boat or boat i don't understand shekina i don't understand your your question please i don't know what you want to mean uh, i don't know what you mean I made a mistake. What did you do? Uh, you made a mistake. What kind of mistake is that? So guys, thank you each and every one of you for being here. Please, if this is your first time here, please consider subscribe to the channel and like the video, like the video. And also consider follow me on my Instagram. Uh, add me on my Instagram where you can get cool and spontaneous raw street videos. Henceforth, my videos are all raw, raw, raw. No faking it, man. I just want to be myself because I have nothing to. <laughs> I have nothing to. Uh, I have no. Uh, I I hold no one anything. So I just want to be myself and do my thing my way. So and also please consider subscribe to my second channel. Tamara, uh, Joel Tamara TV, please let me get to 100 subscribers at the end of this life in that channel. Thanks. So, in essence, people can be from the same country but different tribe and be at war. So, it is not suddenly going to change when we are in a foreign country. Yes, that is why, look, for me, I am not talking about racism anymore. Except I am like someone try to intimidate me or do it, provoke me or try to do that to me direct personally without no any reason. Like my situation in Cyprus and this woman's situation or like this woman's situa situation and what happened to me in like in... Uh, uh, Austria. For me, it's like direct. When it's direct to me, then I can say something. And again, when it was during the time I'm making the like, I'm making videos, because why I even talk about all these, uh, most of these racist videos that I talk about, is because I was making video the moment they, it happened at the right moment. So I have to share. But if like I'm just on my own, just doing my thing, going my way, Whatever thing that happened, it will be because I will not come because my camera was not on then when that thing happened. So it will go behind the scenes. There are countless things that I don't, I cannot share yet, that I am not even sharing, that is happening to me or happen to who I see on the way, or I know on the way, that I know that it is normal as a foreigner. We, between, you said it already, even we black people, we are discriminating ourselves. Even white people that are discriminating themselves. So it's a normal thing. The only thing is that me, I don't like is for them promoting this, promoting this in order to um, belittle black people. And we give in to this because slavery or whatever insult, slave or whatever insult, 
every race in this world under the sun, every race under the sun have been enslaved. So my even enslaved and even destroyed more than the way that more than what happened to black people. But they cover they cover all these things. They cover it. They, they try to bring only the black people on out there to be able to brainwash us, to belittle us, to make us want to feel inferior. So don't allow someone to make you to feel inferior. So we should stop that. That is my. That is where. Uh, that is where I'm going. We should stop that. Because we should stop that. If you don't know, read about your true history and read about the history of this world. You will know. You will know that. Oh, so it, this is it's just a game that we are playing. It is a propaganda that we black people give into. We say it has been for a long time. If, if something has been for a long time, doesn't mean it is right. Why do you accept that? What they will not accept, you, you are accepting it. That is stupidity. So we should stop that. Stop playing victim, black people. That is where I go. I know it's everywhere. Yes, but when someone wants to be like, they are generalizing this, we should stop it. There are even a few days that I, I, I heard that is a, there is a, an application that come out about a slave trade game of black people. And which... How many government that people, these people that is running our, our country, fighting to run our country and killing each other to get power or whatever, what are they doing? It is people in Brazil that protest for them to, to ban that, that application. I don't know if anybody here knew about this uh, very thing I'm talking about. So we should stop. Crushing to find a single woman. You want me to tell you how to find a single woman? I like your video, bro. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm direct, man, I'm direct. Man, you, nonsense that you will not take, you want me to take it, no. So I'm, I, will, I will speak up. I, I'm not that kind of person. Nonsense that you will not take, you want me to take it, no, of course, it's impossible, never. Brother, can you tell me something? What do you know about Maron tribe in Africa, the motherland? Maron tribe, I've never heard about this. Where, what city, um, what country are they? Let me type it. I'm just typing it. I'm, there are a lot of things I have to learn. I just even learned little about my tribe today. So I didn't learn about that. I learned little about my tribe today, Ijo, the Ijo people. Did you know about the Israel people? Because it is also another thing that we did among ourselves. We supposed to be among the major tribe in my country, Nigeria. But if I ask any of you here, you will only tell me Yoruba, Igbo, and Hausa, which is also a mystic. So there are a lot of uh, injustice, like what we just say, injustice be between even ourselves. Maron tribe. It's Maroon tribe Jamaica, I just see immediately. The Miskito Sambu were a Maroon group who formed from slaves who revolted on a Portuguese ship around 1640, wrecking the vehicle on the coast. Very good. Very good for them that they revolt and destroy that, that, that ship. Uh, and form their own settlement. They often mix with indigenous people, eventually evolve into separate Creole cultures, such as the Garifuna and the Muscogos. In the 18th century, illustrated of a man, okay, North and South America, Jamaica, Moristos, okay, it's in Moristos. Okay, they are in the Moristos, I think, yeah. Modern people, black, Kitchenian, the problem with Jamaican. Yes, yes. I just learned about it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Wombin. So I guess you are one of them, Wombin. Where do you go next? 
that is left for me to know and for you to discover on the channel when the times comes on my platforms. Tewi. Tewi. I hope I said it very well. Tewi, the name. We are enslaved and now by Babylon. We are enslaved now by Babylon. Lord. We have, yes, even now. This thing is going on everywhere in the world, but they are not talking. They will talk only about some certain people. They talk about only black people in order to like belittle us. So we should get away from that. No race, no race is out of it. Everybody was enslaved. When your empire falls, they attack you were enslaved. So you come here, there. We, you, we should learn more about ourselves so, we, so that you know much better when you come face these kind of issues, then you defend yourself, you, you shut them off. Those ones, if they, if they are even talking, because they don't know their history. They are maybe the, the, their true history. We say about that, you come in to say you are a black person, you are this, you are making this monkey noise. They too, they don't know their history. They are ignorant. Because everybody sleep. And still we are still of the system of the world. Everybody, in one way, it varies from degree to degree. It is bitter, but it's true. He who Christ set free is free indeed. Freedom is a spiritual state. Uh-huh. Okay. We have to revolutionize our mind everywhere. Revolutionize everything. One bin, they are the rebels that fought in Jamaica, right? Yeah, I think those are the people. They are, they are the people that formed that state also. I am shocked. Why are you shocked, Daniel Kame? Why are you shocked? Hi, Joel. Please do more videos about talking to strangers, how to start conversations, especially with women. Okay, no problem. Like, most of my videos are almost... It's almost uh, that, you know, the way I do it is with anybody. You can talk to anybody anywhere in the world. So even the videos I've, done, I've did already, you can also learn about. Just watch the way I, I do my things and you can uh, depend on your level of confidence. Then you can take it uh, little by little until you get the confidence to walk up to a woman and maybe even... If you want, maybe even take her for a date right away. It all depends on who you are and your level of confidence and, and how grown you have become. So, yes, you can walk up to a woman now and talk to her and even take her out for a date right away. It's possible. It's all depend on you. Where are you right now? I am in France, back home, relaxing and uploading all my videos. So guys, please thank you for liking my videos. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for helping me to grow the channel. Thank you for your awesome support. I really appreciate. And uh, thank you, thank you. If you haven't subscribed, please do that. Do so, it is free. Please help me to grow the channel. Please, let us take the channel to more than 100K, at least 100K before the end of this year. So, guys, please share it with your friends and loved ones. Let's continue to explore. And when I will get there, I have a great surprise for you guys. Have you had, have you had dates with women who you spoke on the street with? Yes. Why not? I'm a man, man. I go on dates. Most countries, most countries I visit, I go on dates. Hey, why not? It's a normal, it's, 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 our, it's our bed right as a man. Brother, one of the biggest problem in this world now is classism, not racism. These are the tools they use to separate white and black farm. And yes, I am from that's tribe yeah okay yeah so we should but we should avoid it because that classism that uh classism the class you are saying i hope i'm i have to bite my tongue to say that if you try to classify them 
they will not abide to it. They will call you all sorts of names. They will say you are a bad person. So why we are accepting it? For example, the so-called human right. They will twist it. Some people will twist the human rights to their set when it is against them, when you are doing something against them. That is when they are talking about human rights. Then they will talk about, but when they are doing something bad, bad against you, against another person, no problem. It's normal. So we should stand up. We should stop speaking grammar. A bully does not understand grammar. Where in the world have you seen a bully understand grammar? Am I wrong? Or am I wrong? If I'm wrong, tell me straight. Someone is killing you. Someone is attacking you. You are speaking grammar. How many of us have died all over the world? They only go to the, the we only make disgraceful protests. The people who are even then they even our people who are bullying us are still making money from that again. <laughs> What kind of nonsense is this? We should revolutionize our mind. They will even print some so-called t-shirts. We will even buy it from them again. <laughs> what kind of what kind of blindness is this? So we should stop it. We should stop it. One being, we should stop it. A bully does not understand grammar. A bully, someone is bullying you, someone is killing you. You, say, oh, uh, you are speaking grammar. <laughs> Stand up. Okay, your people liberate themselves and go and create Jamaica. It's by grammar they used to create Jamaica. The Maram people, the, the state they have, for them to be set, set, set themselves free from that slave, the, uh, the capture as uh, they, they capture them on to go because most of these slaves, some of them is not uh, on their in, uh, it's not their will. It's not their will. They they were some of them, maybe they are going for an errand, they're like an ambush, and they, they it's like a kidnap. That is a kidnap. They kidnap them and take them and force them away through some of our evil leaders of the past. This is what happened. So, this your people, your tribe that get freedom for themselves by fire, by force. Is grammar they speak? There are some certain things is not grammar. Yes, it, I'm going directly to the point. I'm not coming here. I'm, I will not speak political correct things because this is very sensitive issue, and people are dying for it. And what have people done? Our government, what have they done? World leaders, what have they got? What have done? Have they done? They are profiting from it. It suits them. Some are very happy in the television. In front of the television, they will talk. They will talk normal. Like we should stop wasting our time to seek for sympathy, attentions. No. After those people, they will even to talk in the media. They will make money out of it. After the camera is off, they will they are, they are laughing at us, black people. So we should stop it. How do you earn money for your travel, food, and also, bro? I work, and uh, my YouTube channel is giving me something. I put together. I sponsor myself for now, and some people, some uh, accommodations also sponsor me now. So thank you all. You have TikTok? Yes, yes, yes. With me, if you go to my my platform, you will get me with, with my name, even Joel Tamara. Joel Tamara, you type it on TikTok, you get me. I think yeah, you, Joel Tamara. Yes, you will get me on TikTok. How old are you? I'm old enough to marry and give a woman baby. Boot the corruption. Uh -huh. All this is corruption in men's corruption in men's. It's like we should stop this. We should stop this. There are people that will talk all this in. Uh, they will talk this. How would I say? 
in the media, they will be laughing at us. In the media, they will be talking blah, 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 like they are very serious, they're nice, they are happy. They are happy. After when the camera is off, they are insulting us. I think there are some uh, YouTube channel, I think from some Americans are saying uh, some certain, certain issues of just like, like that also. So we should stop it, we should stop it. How many centuries and years have gone? It's not a few days ago, one footballer was a victim, Brazilian footballer was a victim in Spain, in the whole of the stadium. And at the end of the day, they arrested only seven people, not two people. Are you joking? So we should stop this. We should stop. We black people we should stop. That is the only way this thing will stop. When we stop, when we say, okay, no, Pastor, we are tired of this. Nobody will do it for you. So this is what I have to say. So we should not try to speak political correct issue here. You are having problem. You are hungry. Instead of you to go and look for food. You are complaining that, uh, okay, let me say yes, you are hungry and you have money to go and look for the food. You are complaining and saying someone should make food for you. Where is the food? You don't want to do, do the food. You don't want to go and look for the food. We cannot go anywhere this way. You cannot go anywhere. So we should change our mind. We revolutionize our mind. That is my own point. So black people, we got a serious problem. Can you imagine that some of our women, they don't even like their own hair. They prefer to wear the hairs from other people. Shame on. My brother, all this we should stop it. All this, you are, you are making a very great point. We should stop all this. We should stop all this. And even when our women, when they do their natural air, they are more beautiful. With this useless air, air they put there, they look like, more, I'm very sure I'm going to be, they look like zombies. When they are natural and gone with their natural air, with their natural beauty, superb. African queens, they are queens. For me, uh, all the girls like uh, my sisters that I, I date, like, hey, please, make your air normally. Make your air normal. No, make your air normal. Allow your air to grow. If you don't have air, cut your air like a man. As time goes on, your face will rhyme with that your hairstyle, with your shape, and you will be beautiful to any man. And less problem, less sickness. She stop this inferiority complex. They bring this propaganda to us and they finish us. And they, 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 some, because most of us were naive. It's a very great point you are making. Never. I'm telling you. We should be proud of our culture, tradition, and country. Simple as that. Everybody is different. Black people are black people. We have our culture. We have our way of doing things. We have our food. We have our style. We have our music. We have our way of doing things. We should stay that way. Simple. I heard that even those heirs, I don't know if it's true. Some say it's like the heirs of people that have died. They caught the heirs of people that have died. Imagine you're putting someone's dead body's head in your head. What kind of thing is that? Bro, you bring this up. I, I'm not in, this life was not about this, man. What kind of thing is that? I thank God that I don't have sisters that do that. I don't have. Very rarely, I see even my mom 
very since I know she used her hair, it's her own hair, natural. My mom, natural. I think I have some videos of my mom. My mom, natural, natural, natural beauty. And she's very beautiful. Very beautiful. I couldn't find it, man. Have you been to India? Not yet. Not yet. I'm coming. I'm coming. My India. Shout out to my Indian people. I'm coming. Zombies. I'm telling you. That will so, so shock them. I'm telling you. No, I'm selling my truth now. Most of our sisters that have those airs, when I see them, sometimes I'm like kind of like shocked. This is my own personal, I, I never said it anyway, but I'm kind of like shocked when I see them sometimes. I don't really like it. And again, when they are in your hand, and get, uh, again, when you hug them, when they are in your hand, that that their air is biting you, is, is uh, uh, aching you. I don't know if you have an experience as a man. A bro a, a, a brother say, I don't know if you have dated our sisters that have those kind of hair. When you take them in your hand, in your body, in your chest, those hairs are aching you. Have you been to India? No, not yet. I can't wait. I can't wait. I'm coming to India. So thank you. Panic, how are you? How is how are you? Where are you connected from from India? Some are going to do the surgeries for breasts. I am crying a lot when I see these things happening. My brother, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Patrick, I don't know. I'm telling you. This all nonsense. I am from India. When you come here, I want to meet you, Joel. Oh, okay. No problem. <laughs> no problem. It, it is a pleasure. It will be a pleasure to meet you as well. Thank you. What city are you from? My tribe has been fight, frightening for years. Now the government is using their capitalist mindset. This is it. Our problem, our problem, I don't know. I don't know. Sometimes is it, sometimes I ask that we black people, do, are we caused by God? Uh, are we caused because uh, a lot of things in the world have been falsified, you know, have been changed and like cleansed from the 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 books, the real historical book of the world for now. So a lot of things is going. Sometimes just this is just my own mindset. Sometimes are we those people that we sin against God and it cost? But God, even though you cost us, they said we our forefathers have been enslaved for like four hundred years. That is what they say. That's what we learn. That's what they let us to know. So at least 400 years, you know, the course of God is only 400 years. But I know that during those years, if any of our leaders commit another atrocities, it will go again. But at least God, please forgive us and take away this course from our head so that we can know ourselves. So that we cannot allow anybody, even a man, another man to come to it like a diminish us or try to like disrespecting us the way it is all over the world it is not good i i don't like it i don't like it on the people in jamaica with the help from foreign aid and grants from these foreign nations then they take over our country we should stop this aids <laughs> this aids i learned something few days ago, and ever since I've learned this already, already, anywhere I go, I don't want to take anything from anybody. Yes, even though you want to help me, I will make sure that I gave you something, I paid you something, or I did something for you. For example, the accommodations that are, are uh, that I said I sponsor in my videos are the people that, okay, they said, okay, Joel, come and stay in our place. Then I said, okay, for me to stay in your place, I have to sponsor, I have to promote your business. So it's giving, giving. I will not go to any country and anybody wants to take something, only take and go away. No. 
Africans should stop taking any aid from anybody. If we want to go out of this nonsense, we should stop taking any aid from anybody. We should focus our mind in technologies, inventions, entrepreneurial. This is the way to go. Education, learning, invention, scientists, technologies. This is the way to go. We don't need anybody's money. We don't need anybody's aid. Those aids are coming with, uh, how will I say, are coming with conditions. And some people, when you're taking, taking, you're eating your destiny. So I don't want to take anything from anybody. It's not that because I don't like people. I like you, but I don't want to take because I don't want to put my destiny in problem because I am not a slave. So I don't take anything from anyone. And do you know what happened? A few days ago, a boy, one guy from, I don't know, from uh, Romania commented that uh, there is one video I did in Tagu Morish that the guy said that uh, uh, the couple, they tried to buy me a ticket that at the end of the day, I, I said, no, I don't want. And I finally paid my ticket. The guy come and write that, that this people paid you your ticket. Imagine if it is true that these people really paid my ticket. The way he accused me, I cannot reply anymore because of the thing these people did for me. Did for me, but I said no, Mister Man. These people did not pay my ticket. They insisted. They are very caring. They are loving. I love them, and they I, they love me. They show love. I love what they did. I cherish them, but they didn't pay my ticket. I insisted and I pay it for myself. So when you started taking AIDS, when you started taking AIDS, you are automatically taking help, only taking, 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 taking. You are killing your destiny. And in case when there is something to talk, to stand up to talk, you cannot talk because you have taken help, 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 help because it's someone who is helping you. You take money from the person. It is, it is also very illustrated in the Bible. Esau sell his, his best uh, birthright. Why? He take food from Jacob. So everything Jacob did to him, it will work. When someone have already tran either transaction, they give you money or they give you something, food or whatever thing, to take something from you, even though a cost they lay on you, that cost will work because, they have, you, have, because you have taken something from them. It will work. This is our problem. So when you take something, even in in in, a, in the dark world, even the 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 the, the, the uh, witch doctors, the sorcerers, the witches, that is what they do. When you fall victim, you take. That is why even when I go invited to party, before I go to the party, I have to make sure I am going with something. I have to make sure I'm going with something. If I'm invited to a party, I have to make sure that I have to go. If I'm invited in wedding, before I will take anything from that wedding or drink something or eat something, I will make sure I, I pay, I, I like, I, 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 I give the couple, the brides, the, the, the wedding couple, I have to make sure I give them something before I will leave. We should stop taking that. And we are the richest. We don't need money for me. We don't need any aid. Anywhere, I like still Europe, especially the Netherlands, which I never even been there. Yes, I don't worry. One day you will see when I will be in the Netherlands. I will vlog there. Patrick, leave the ladies out of this one, please. No offense, brother. The problem is serious worldwide. Uh huh. So this is a. We have to be serious. We have to be. It's a serious thing, and we are taking. We are look as a black person. We're supposed to be very, very serious at this point in our life. Very, very serious, and we are the people that are even joking. People that even they are okay for them. They are the ones even more serious than us. What kind of nonsense is this? 
Me, I'm addressing my people, my black people. I'm addressing my people. And it is the truth. If I am making, if I'm, I'm saying what is not true, you are all here. Most of us maybe are even older than me here. Or I, I even have more experience than me here. Share it. Though anyway, it was not on today's topic, so I have to end it here. I am from Bangalore, India. Okay, Bangalore. Okay. Of course, you. I think it's one of the. Uh, is it is the second or third largest city in the in the country or what? Because at least I have to visit Bangalore anyway. Is it a Bangalore, the, the third largest or second largest city in the country? Share the live. Share the live, everyone, please. Yes, share this live because anyway, my it was all about the experience of Slovakia, but along the line, we share a lot of things about our people. So, hey, uh, it goes like that, all I say. It's part of the ministry. The European people have more respect in between them. Uh -huh. I wish to go visit their ones at least to experience it. <laughs> my brother, take it easy so so that you not be <laughs> sometimes the, but the, the life here is good uh, they, they build their country they work hard to build their country this is what I am asking why will we everybody wants to run now to here how even in fact even our leaders they come but they come in here and they see the way they do things here but when they go back home they don't want to build their place like here we should be more, maybe more as a Patrick, maybe he has not been to this part of the world, he cannot understand most of the things I'm saying or why I'm saying this, but he cannot understand because experience is the best teacher. Because sometimes when we are saying some things, they cannot understand until when they uh, experience it by themselves. So I hand it there. But we can do much better. Trainer, wow. Why why you said wow? Why you said wow, trainer? Are you still there? I heard that some of the European countries, the public transport is free. <laughs> Mr. Man, your dream, you, you are that is why I told you already that please take it easy. <laughs> take it easy. <laughs> there is nothing free. <laughs> take it easy, my Mr. Man. <laughs> take it easy. Africa, the best place. Hmm. Africa, yes. Africa, a lot of great places. Africa is great. Yes, that is true. It is more Africa. The level Africa is for people who have traveled, for Africans that have traveled, you will know that, yes, we have a home. And that is why we have to do something. What's your body count i don't understand i don't understand what you mean i don't understand what you mean um, raspberry nation so guys thank you all for joining it has been two hours two hours two hours <laughs> one bin is a lol what do you one one bin why is it lol So guys, I'm going to end the live for today. It was awesome. We talked a lot. We shared a lot. We go even depth. In fact, we even go out of our topic that does, that does not have nothing to do with my experience in Slovakia. So we shared a lot. We shared a lot. Yes, in Luxembourg, the public bus is free. Oh, really? Uh, okay. I've never been to Luxembourg, so I didn't know about that. Okay. Oh, nice. Nice. She do she do she it looks like a friend of mine. I don't know. Uh, where are you connecting from, brother? This guy looks like a friend of mine, but I don't know if it's the same name. The footballer that I met in Croatia.
So guys, thank you, thank you. Body count is how many people you have been with in bed. A bit of a misplaced question. Ah, uh, gentlemen, don't kiss and tell. How can you expect me to say uh, counting all the women I've been in bed with, man? You don't do that. I can even I can say yes. Maybe I go to date. I uh, in any country I have uh, the country I visited. Yes. But uh, I cannot go and tell you that, uh, no, 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 man. If I did that to your sister, will you like it? I started counting, yeah, I made this and she's this. No, 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 no. Gentlemen, don't kiss and tell. We can just say, yeah, it happened because of you want to know. Okay, but we, we, we close it there. We don't go in details. <laughs> Talking about women. But, but not only us, but not only that guy. There are some people that their questions are so personal and so uncomfortable to answer because it's a private issue. And imagine, I put you now, if it is your sister that I have time with, and I'm talking about her right here, will you like it? No. So we should not do not everything we should ask. From Nigeria, living in Canada. Ah, okay, okay. Shout out to my Nigerian people in Canada <laughs> and my Nigerian people back home. Oh, thank you. Thanks for joining. How do you get to my channel? How do you know me? Thanks for joining. And what city are you from? In Canada. What city do you live in Canada? Yes, <laughs> yes, gentlemen, don't kiss and tell. How do you ask women for dates? Come on. If you are here in this platform and you want to meet with me, of course, you're an adult. Come on. Some of the European embassies here in Africa, when you go there, they are looking at you as if you made a mistake or you lost for the address and it's embarrassing that is your country it is sorry it is our leaders have put us in that place it is our leaders have put us in that position that question is for our leaders you should post this to them and they are totally unconsigned. They are totally unconsigned. Totally like, don't give a fuck. That is the right word to use. I don't know. Total unconsigned. Where are you from? I'm from Nigeria. What work do you do in France? This guy's questions. Your questions are too personal, so I'm not answering anymore. It's okay. Toronto, okay. So, thank you, man. Thank you, guys. Uh, raspberry was kind of... Uh, raspberry is kind of very, very... Uh... So, oh, Nigeria. Yes, I'm from Nigeria. Nice. And you, where are you from? David Acho. You look like a like French name. I don't know. Where are you from, David? So guys, thank you, thank you each and every one of you for joining. I really appreciate your time. It has been an awesome time. Yeah, please keep on liking and subscribe to my channel. Share my channel with your friends and loved ones. And don't hesitate to share with me what kind of content you want me to do next in my upcoming travels. <clears throat> and please share your appreciation if you know that my videos have helped you or help your family members. Let me know. And my brother from Toronto, how did you get to my channel? How do you get my channel? Uh, see, do, see, she does here. How did you get my channel? How did you know my channel? I want to know. Congo, DR Congo, yeah, peace out. Oh, thank you, thank you. Shout out to my DR people. Love you guys. DR Congo, thank you, thank you. God bless Africa. Amen. God bless Africa. 
I am curious about you. You are like a role model for me. <laughs> My brother, Amen. thank you. But pick only the good part of me because every man has his own flaws. Take only the good part and maximize it with your own good part and be a much better person. So thank you for being, thank you. When are you gonna set up the live call? or shot on the live. Okay. I would I would have even do okay next time. Next time I will make that. Next time I will do that. I will do that on the on the live. I will bring I will invite some people, some of you guys. Uh, okay. Uh listen. Uh this is uh, this guy just make uh, another great uh you know uh bring us another great idea. I want to bring you guys next time now spontaneously uh, so follow me on my instagram and my facebook page because that is where i will send you the link so guys follow me on my facebook and instagram so in the future in my upcoming life i'm going to invite someone now it is already too late because it's already more than two hours so i'm going to end the live and as soon as i finish explaining and giving shout out to everybody that is here so Next time, I'm going to invite someone, those of you that want to come direct and chat direct and uh, chat direct with me and with the community, I'm going to invite you. So follow me on my uh, Facebook page, follow me on my Instagram, because it's there, I will send you the link from there. So from there, you can be able to connect. So this is how we do it. If you like it, Give, if you like it, let me know. If you like that idea, like from this, uh, uh, from uh, one bin, uh, one bin suggested it. So next time I'm going to invite you guys. One bin, I really want to see you. So sometimes you can also show me your. Like, I, I want you guys, um, not only one bin, every one of you. Sometimes you can show me uh, around your your environment. Yeah, the people want to know, want to see you from maybe for some people that is a need. Africa, in Asia, in India, America, Europe, yeah, so that you maybe sometimes you can even open your window, take us outside. And my window now is night now. If not, I would have taken you, you'd have seen my my window, my compound, my areas here. So it's going to be more lively. If you like it, let me know. Alexandra Lino, thank you. Hello, Lino, how are you? God bless you too. God bless you too. Thank you for joining. Where are you connecting from? It is very late now. I'm sorry, but hey, I'm going to end the live now because I don't want it to be so long. It's already so long now. I wanted to join the live fam. Okay, next time, next time. So follow me on follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram. So next time, when I then I will like pick one of you or a few of you, then I will send you. Um, the link on the Instagram or on Facebook. So follow me on Facebook and also my Facebook page and also my Instagram so that I can be able to send you the link. Thank you. Your videos have helped me to have better conversation, Joel. Oh, oh, nice, nice. Thank you, thank you. So share my videos, share my videos with your friends and loved ones and ask them to subscri subscribe, keep on subscribing. Share it, please. Help me to grow. Popped up in YouTube and I got addicted to it. Wow. Wow, that is one of the, oh, one of the best, in, best news I've had this evening also. One of the best. Thank you. Thank you, man. I, thank you that you, you got addicted and you're enjoying it. <laughs> Oh, nice. Thank you for being around and you're welcome to the community. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, nice. Please make a live with a open telephone calls. Okay. Okay. So you want me to call you guys direct? That is what you mean? Yeah, what I mean is like I'm going to invite you. You're going to be alive and live calm with me. You're going to appear like I am in the calm in, in, your, in your screen now. You're going to appear here. The people I invite will appear here. So this is what will happen. Living in Cape Town. Oh, okay, nice, nice. Oh, how is Cape Town today? I am from Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, but live in Sao Paulo. 
Oh, shout out to my Brazilians. It's one of the second Brazilians in the community today, I guess. Yes, we have one, uh, some guy, by Notopo. Yes, that is his, his, his name on uh, YouTube. He's a Brazilian also. Thank you for joining, Alexand uh, Alexandre Lino. We can we do video call on Instagram? Yes. Okay, let me go live on Instagram. Okay, guys, join me on, on, on Instagram for some minutes. Are you ready? Just for some minutes. I will not take long because it's very late now. Pop up on YouTube. Pop up YouTube and I got so addicted to it after the first click. Wow. Wow. Pop up in YouTube and I became addicted to it after the first click. Oh. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, I want to do live call with you. Okay, join me on live. Who's, whichever that wants to join me on live on Instagram should join me now. So I'm going to end this live here now and we can be on live on uh, on Instagram. So any questions you have, any questions you want to ask, you can ask on, on Instagram right, right away. Which part of France do you live? I live in the Normandy. I'm like I'm already preparing now for the Instagram live. So here we go. Here we go. Normandy. Pop up and need to forget a little. <laughs> okay, I am good. Oh, thanks. So thank you, thank you, each and every one of you. Thank you, thank you, Lino, for joining. Thank you, each and every one of you for joining. So I'm going to end the live so we can um, and uh, go to Instagram. I, will, I am on live on Instagram. So follow me on, uh, on Instagram and let's chat on Instagram. Thank you. God bless France because at least it's accommodated a lot of our fellow brothers and sisters in the country. Yes, yes. Sure, anytime, bro. I will like that we will link up on Facebook. Okay, also Facebook, but Facebook not tonight. But now I will go on Instagram because it's already too late. Very rainy in Cape Town, Lowell. Okay, join me on. Please go to Brazil. No problem. I wait on YouTube Live, bro. Okay. I don't know how to get in Instagram. You just follow me, then I will I will add you. I will then you it's normal, just normal, normal like here yeah, in on YouTube. So, guys, thank each and every one of you for joining. It has been an awesome time, and I really appreciate and I can't wait to be with you guys again. So until then, it has been a very wonderful time. Have a wonderful and inspiring day if it is a day in where you are if it is night where you are have a great evening and a great rest and see you guys on instagram whosoever that uh, want to join that still have time to to chat please like share your link to all your social media platform below yes 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 I've already, I, I, it's already, I've already shared it. When you go to even to my Instagram, it's already there. It's shared already there. And uh, even Facebook is already shared there. So it's already shared. So thank you. Even uh, in TikTok, it's already there. So thank you, each and every one of you. Thank you for joining. I love you guys. Love you guys. Peace and love. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you, Walden.